Welcome to the Star Trek Deck Building Game Introduction Setting Up the Game Board. Now I'm going to be showing you how to set up the Star Trek Deck Building Game to play your first game. These are all the cards that come in the game and you won't actually be using everything, but I will show you what you're going to be using. So first let's go ahead and set up the game for the five players. What we'll do is we're going to create the five starting decks for each of the five players. To do that, we're going to take one of each of the five starter cards and combine them. So we have the base of maneuvers, so we'll give one to each player. Then we have Starfleet Academy, Diagnostic Check, Triporter. and phasers. So those are the first five cards that you're going to put in the starting deck. Additionally, you're going to have three Ensign, we'll put the rest over here, and then we also have two lieutenants, again we'll put the rest of the lieutenants up here, and then lastly we have commanders, but those don't actually go in the starter deck, so those will go up here. So now we have ten cards in each of the starting decks, and that's going to form the starting deck. So we're going to shuffle those up, and now each player has their starting deck of ten cards. Additionally, we're going to go ahead and give each player a dice, which they will use to keep track of damage on their starship. There are five dice that come with the game. Now next, we would give them the starting starship, which is called your flagship. Each of our three different scenarios for the game has a different starting ship. So based on the scenario that you choose, that the sh that's the ship that you're going to go with. So today I'm going to show you how to set up the exploration scenario, which is the gold border cards. So if you look carefully, if you turn the cards over, you'll find five cards with instructions, and that's going to be your starting flagships. So each player will get one of those. In this scenario, they are identical, so everyone's going to start off with the exact same ship. Next, we're going to go ahead and set up Starbase. So we've already placed our Ensign, Lieutenant, and Commander. These are the three basic characters that are always available on Starbase. We're also going to set up the Starbase deck. We're going to go ahead and grab all the cards, which are maneuvers, characters, setups, and two special cards. These all have a blue border. We're going to go ahead and take them and shuffle them. This is called our Starbase deck. That will go right here. Uh, we're then going to set up our Starbase search area, which will be the nine cards from the top of this deck. So we're going to go ahead and place nine cards, that, which are random, onto this board. These nine cards will be available for purchase throughout the game by any player on their turn. But when a player buys a card from this area, it is removed and the next card from the top of the Starbase deck is flipped to replace it. So this area will change throughout the game. When a card is removed and discarded, it will go into the Starbase discard area, and a new card will take its place. Okay, so now we've set up Starbase. The Starbase area that you can buy cards from is these nine cards, as well as the three that, you, that are the basic characters. Next, we're going to go ahead and set up the Space deck. So the Space deck is the part that changes based on what scenario you play. It's going to always have 15 standard starships, which have a purple border. So we're going to take these. Now the next 25 cards that go in here are based on your scenario. So we're setting up the exploration scenario, so we would take the 25 exploration cards, which have a gold border. If we wanted to play the Klingon Civil War scenario, we would instead take the 25 red bordered Klingon Civil War scenario cards, and again, if we wanted to set up the Borg scenario, we would get the 25 Borg scenario cards that have a green border. 
In, with, when you're playing with the Borg scenario, you're also actually going to use these um, Borg cards, which are special cards that have special rules. And if you were going to use these, they would be on the board to the side. Uh, but we're not going to be using the Borg scenario this time. So we're going to go ahead and use the Exploration scenario, which has 25 Gold Border cards. And we have the 15 Standard Starships. We're going to combine them. We're going to go ahead and shuffle them. And they all have the Space Deck back. So once we shuffle this thoroughly, it's going to go ahead and go right here. So now the game has been set up to play. 